Tingle, tingle, kaloo, limpa! Previously on Let's Play Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. Madame Aroma would surely say the same thing, wouldn't she, Mayor Dottor? Uh, let's not bring my wife into this. Oh, forgive me. I am Toto, manager of the band, the Indigo Girls. This some woman, she play too. She play knick-knack on my shoe. Uh, oh, excuse me. So anyway, like I was saying, there is a way you can use this mask. So let's put it on. And if you hold the shield up while pressing B, you'll actually avoid taking damage. Now keep in mind that every time you use this mask, you have to give it a moment to kind of reform back on Link's face. So it won't actually be able to be used like you know, in a snap, you know, every time you need to use it. So, be wary of that when you're using this mask. Um, there's one other thing I want to go ahead and take care of, and this is actually quite noteworthy, it's quite funny. <laughs> it has, it, it made me laugh the first time whenever I played this game and I had to do this, but you can find yourself another heart piece without even leaving town, just by simply going out and getting the Deku land title deed, and you don't even have to have that. You can have any other kind of uh, paper item. You can have, like, uh, mail or anything like that. But I think it's just simpler to... Well, actually, it's upstairs. No. Is it upstairs? Yeah, it's upstairs. No, actually, it's downstairs. I'm sorry. In the stock pot in at night, at about midnight, and you have to do this... Um, you have to go through the Deku way unless you, of course, have a room here. You're going to come into the room right to the left, uh, first room on the left, and you'll find... Holy crap! It's a hand. Hi, hand. How you doing? Tape, please. This guy sounds pretty desperate. Let's go and help him out. How's this? Yeah! Oh, oh, yeah! You saved me. here. I'll give it... No! No, I don't! Please! You don't have to! It's... To oh, man, it's all... Oh, okay. You got a heart piece! Yay! We collected another heart container. Dang, we're racking up on these things, baby. Who? Well, that person was added to your notebook. <laughs> you helped out, him out of a jam. This added to your notebook. I don't know how many of you have experienced that when you sit down on the toilet in your own home... Or sit on your own throne, I guess, you could say. And you go to take a dump, and you didn't even bother checking to see if there's toilet paper. And you're reaching out like, oh, crap. And the toilet paper that you need, that you can restock up, is like nowhere near where you need to be. And you're like, then you're forced to have to call out for help, like that guy. But, man, I could even imagine being stuck in a bathroom that, like, goes in the ground. And just, oh, my gosh. Well, anyway, shenanigans aside... Thanks, guys, for watching. Love y'all. Don't let your tails flap, and I'll see you next time. Alrighty, then. Sorry about that random abrupt cut, guys. I figured I'd go ahead and get just a bit more done, because three minutes of video content just is not enough, really, for a video. I mean, I'm sorry. I just, I can't accept that. So, what I did, I decided to do for more video content, I guess, for the rest of this video. Plus, I want to go ahead and get to the first area of this game is I grinded up some rubies oh, excuse me and I went ahead and gr gathered exactly 999 rupees inside this guy's bank in my bank account uh, so excuse me I can show you the first prize the second prize you get by saving up rubies constantly how much how much rubies you only get one penny for me that's my two cents from you for you really are you really depositing one ruby? Yes. That's it? That ain't nothing at all, big spender. But if you say so. Alright, little guy. Now I've got a total of 1,000 rupees from you. What's this? You've already saved up 1,000 rupees. Well, little guy, here's your special gift. Take it. Yeah. What? Five rupees! Okay, I guess I'll just take it. That's what they call interest. <coughs> Sorry, I can't do, I can't do my what 
anymore because it just, right, or at least for now, because it tears up my throat and my vocal cords, I think. So that was the main thing I wanted to show you. The second thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and purchase the bigger bomb bag because if you stop this, if you stop sock, saking, sacking, sacking them, I don't know. <laughs> if you stop them from stealing the old lady's bomb bag stuff, um, you'll be able to purchase it. Welcome. Hey, how's it going? We just got a larger bomb bag in stock. Yay! Let's let's go ahead and buy that then. And you can buy this for 90 rubies. And as you can see, it can hold up to 30 rubies. So, woohoo! Go us! If you don't stop sacking the thief, you can purchase it in the curiosity shop, which I'll show in a little bit. Anyway, thank you very much. Thanks, dude! There will be fireworks show on the night before the carnival. You should go see it come again. Sure, I'll be sure to do that. Let me see. Can you talk to the old lady? Yeah, you can. Ah, oh, nice fella helped me out. So we can finally sell big bomb bags. Once again, the giants are looking out for me. Um, mommy, don't go picking up bomb bags in the middle of the night anymore, please. It's like asking to be mugged. And I've actually heard that a thief has been lurking on the outskirts of town. But it's been our lifelong dream to sell big bomb bags since back in your daddy's day. Since we can't get the Goron made goods, this was our big chance, Sonny. I just don't want anything to happen to you, Mommy. Aww, that is so heartfelt and warm. No, oh, I'm just melting inside and I'm turning into putty. But, in all seriousness, uh, they did actually give us some rather in useful information. She talked about the the four giants, which um, we're thinking like, okay, what in the world is that supposed to mean? And he was talking about a thief that apparently is Roman town, that guy that we stopped trying to rob the bomb bag uh, off the lady. So, anyhow, this is the curiosity shop. Generally, there will be a, an item or two here. Actually, there will be an item if there's an item stolen or anything. I'll go ahead and just give him his voice. Yeah, tonight I got nothing to sell. I kid you not. Can I buy something off you? I'll pay you good for it. Show me with the C button. Normally, if you have, like, something in your bottle or whatever, you could probably get some rubies, but if you don't have anything, that's about it. <laughs> Thanks. Come again. The man from the curiosity shop was added to your notebook. Indeed he is. I'm telling you, man. Everybody's just... I don't know what his problem or his issue will be, but whatever, man. His issue is actually a little complicated. In my, pers in my personal opinion, I, I just I don't understand it completely. Hello, ladies! How may I help you to... DON'T BOTHER US! Um... Wow. The Rosa twins, uh, Rosa's sisters, twin dancers were added to your notebook. Yeesh. Well then, I shall leave them to their practice. Uh. Alrighty, well, I guess for one more thing to go ahead and do, if you go down to the laundry pool, which is where you got the striped fairy, there's actually one other thing you can do inside Clock Town without even leaving this place. You don't have to do it, of course, because, again, if you're not 100% in it, you don't have to do it, but... At midnight on each of the nights, you'll find Guru Guru sitting out here just playing his little thing. So, let's listen to him. La 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 la. They said I was much too loud when I practiced in my room. They got the mad side. Oh, I'm sorry. Hey, <laughs> now I'm sad. I'll just think about the past to keep my mind off the bad. Ah, yes, I'll do that. Dear guests, long ago I was in an animal troupe with dro dogs and donkeys and such. Why could I, why could I, why could I man join? That's cause a man is an animal too, my boy. They were all great, but there was one thing I didn't like about it. Why was the, why was the, why was the dog the leader? Was it cause something was wrong with me, sir? Oh, that dog was an amazing leader. He always had a stellar troupe, no matter what animals he had to rock with. That's why I, that's why I, that's why I stole it. The dog's mask, I stole it. I wanted it because it was the leader's mask. 
but I no longer need it. I give it to my guest. Da 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 da! We got the Bremen's mask. This mask belonged to the leader of an animal troupe. Try parading around tiny young animals. Jeez, Michael Jackson, much? The leader was a good instructor. His members matured quickly and they became adults in an instant. Guru Guru, the traveling musician, was added to your notebook. You listened to his confession of guilt. This was added to your notebook. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, excuse me. Sorry about that. Well, that's pretty much all I have to do. I will meet you guys on dawn of the first day and we can finally get this party rolling. So, see you in the first day. Dawn of the first day, 72 hours remain. And like that, we're back. Once again on the very first day. And normally, like I said, I would do this kind of thing off screen. Oh, jeez, hold on. Forgot to do that. Duh. Slow down time, man. Jeez, what's your problem? Forgetting some simple material? What's the heck? What the heck, man? Seriously. <laughs> okay. So let's go ahead and finally get out of here and go to Termina Field. Because I need some fresh air, man. That's just gonna drive me nuts. Dude, come on. Stroop raw there! Have you some air in the swamp? It is dangerous outside the town wall, so I can't allow a child like you to... Huh? A sword? My apologies, sir. It was wrong of me to treat you like a child. A southern swamp I would fall lies in this direction. Be careful. Uh-huh. I will. It does make you wonder, though, what all's out here. So here we are. Termina Field. And as I'm sure you know who any Spanish speakers or anybody who's heard of this word, Termina is the he, she, it, f or you, I think it's informal or formal, one of the two, form of to end, basically. So he, she, or it ends. So the world will end, I think, is what it's trying to say or something. I don't know. <laughs> who knows? Who knows, right? Real quick, though, I want to go ahead and show something that's kind of amusing. I've been dying, itching to show this. I'm like... Uh, uh, must, must show, must show you. It's actually kind of noteworthy. If you come up here out, just outside the, <laughs> excuse me, the telescope guy's house, right where this tree is, you'll see this guy. I think you could probably could have spotted him from inside there. You'll see him in the tree. You can't really talk to him or anything. What we can do is you can roll right into the tree. Okay. Well, that is if you roll into the tree. Thump. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and take these. Hey! I stole that ruby from a crow, man! Don't go stealing it, man! Oh, my ankle! Oh, the agony! Oh, the pain! <laughs> Sorry. That is such a weird Sazira. I just... I, I thought that was really... Very creative of the Zelda team to come, just throw that in there, you know? I mean, there's other things in here that are like that. It's funny as all get out. But I was, I've was i been itching to show you guys that because I just, I don't know. I, I had to show you. Um, Yeah, this is all the time I have for now. Thank you guys for watching. Love you all. Don't let the channel swap. And stay tuned because next time we are heading to the Southern Swamp. See ya.